Hello everyone, it's Girl in Minecraft. Welcome to some more of my Create Stellar mod pack playthrough. Um, I know I have been really like sidetracked with all the things going on and I finally got brass going. So we can now make some progress on like making the crafting machines and like smelters and all the cool create things. Uh, I'm stoked to do like mining and stuff. I want to see if I can build a machine that'll clear like a whole forest area uh, also as well. <laughs> but I uh, have neglected the main like goal that we had originally in the beginning. Turtles are like stacking on each other. Anyways, but we're going to go see this castle in the background here. This super cool castle over here in the woods that I spawned near and uh, I still want to do that. <laughs> anyway, it's a pillager castle and I think I am more than well enough prepared. I've got lots of armor, I've got really good weapons. So you know what, I was just thinking in this part, why don't I just go and clear the castle or at least try to, uh, it might take me a long time, <laughs> well maybe not as long as this thing took, this thing took ages to do, but this dungeon is probably not as big. So, I don't know. What do you guys think? I think I'm just going to go and clear this castle, this part, and that's going to be what we're going to do. Um, and then after that, I want to do go back and do more create stuff. Um, I do want to clear a big area to build like a zoo of sorts for all of my like cool like exotic animals. <laughs> like... I don't know if you can consider foxes exotic, but, um, you know, they're like not cows and sheep and pigs animals. So, um, okay. I do have to confess, <laughs> there was a point where I came over here and I wanted to see, you know, what this castle was about. And it was while I was off camera. These are cool looking candles. Um, and I hit the lever and I opened the front door. So, I don't think I can close it. Yeah, it doesn't close anymore, but it is pretty cool how they, like, rigged up these dungeons where um, it actually, like, operates the door. So, ah! Oh, jeez. We're already going for it. Uh, okay, so there's a spawner here. Just break that. Here's somebody. Ooh, okay, so there's, like, a second level. There we go. Oh, there you are. Okay. Where'd you spawn from? Where did he spawn from? Aha, there's one over here. Okay. They're like under the carpet, so I can't tell. a cool place. Man, I would love to set my base up in here. I'll have to um, ditch my build that I did though. That's kind of a shame. But this place would be so sick for a base. I don't know why I didn't come here sooner. I guess I was just worried that I would- oh jeez. I guess I was a little worried that I wouldn't be able to like do it. To use my shield, but oh well. Where did those guys come from? Is there a spawner over here? Ah, here we go. Oh, are they coming from upstairs? Maybe that's where they're coming from. They might be falling down the stairs. I thought maybe there was a spawner over here. Oh. Um, is there anything else over here? It's just like a little planter box farm. Oh, how dare you break the box? These might be my future crops. How dare you? Okay, let's check back over here. There's like this really cool looking kitchen. Oh, that's cool. I like how they use the invisible roof, uh, the glass item frames that um, they look, they look uh, like they're 
not there. Very cool. Got honey jars, a bit of banana peel. I like that. Nice touch. Purr's journal. Ooh, should we read this journal? Let's just get rid of these. Oh, let me just read it. Okay. Johnny went crazy again the other day. I'm still baffled that he hasn't been exiled to the Chattered Lands. Paul was almost murdered and over some over undercooked ribs. Next time I get food from Paul, I'll have to give him a nice tip. Hmm. Oh, okay. There's a spawner here. What are these? Bonded leather? Bonded rabbit hide. What? Um. Okay. What's up here? Who's there? I hear somebody getting hurt. Okay, this is a really cool room. Oh yeah, this is cool. So it's like the cut version of that stuff that I have in my ceiling. Got some armor in here. I'll have to check out the armor and stuff later. I'll probably loot this place after I've uh, um, cleared it. Okay, we got a dude up here. This is a really cool room. It's like a library like a meeting room, kind of. Yeah, it's like a meeting room. Jeez. It's clearly a spawner here. Oh, there's some guys down there. That's probably who I'm hearing. Is this a maze or just... Just like a... That's cool, they used looms to like look like empty bookshelves. Uh, what is over here? No surprises, hopefully. Okay, it's just like a little library. Nothing, nothing too crazy. And was there something over here? It feels like there's something over here. Hmm. Uh, oh, got some seeds. Mystical Enlightenment. Uh, Bane of Illagers. Okay. Uh, yeah, like I said, I'm gonna have to loot this all when I'm done. Because right now, I just want to clear all the enemies out. Okay. This is a neat room. What is this? Powdered snow and lava. Cool. I'd love to be able to build something like this. Oh, this is like the quarters. Uh, here it is. Get rid of that. It's like the guards' quarters. This is a cool little bunk beds. I like that. Very nice touch. Okay. Let's keep going. Got some outside guards. Hello. Okay, this is just a corridor outside. Nothing... Nothing really going on out here, it doesn't look like. Okay. Let's keep going. Spawner here. Oh, jeez. Hello. Put that back. Alright, we got some people up here. Ooh, okay, this is like a bigger room. Are there... Are there animals in cages in here? What the heck? <gasps> there are! Oh my god, this is perfect! I could use these for uh, my, like... Exotic collection. I'm as bad as them. What's that? What are you? Are you wait, are you like a oh you're like a lizard, okay. Oh <gasps> there's villagers in here. And a golem. How did this golem not like kill these guys though? Golem bro doesn't note his own strength. What are you? 
A turtle maybe? And is that like a tiger? <gasps> so cool! Oh, dude. Uh, there's nobody in here. Oh, wait, there's another guy here. Hold on. Is there... Oh, okay. There is a spawner. Uh, here it is. Uh, yeah, is that like... Oh, it's one of those those rock things. There's a bear up there, obviously. Is there another spawner? Is there anything under the table? No. A slime! Oh wait, like supplementary cages are in this? Why didn't I notice that? Oh, that's awesome! Because those you can capture mobs and stuff in them. Uh, I think it has to be smaller mobs though, so I can't just like capture anything. Okay, is there another spawner? Up here somewhere? I feel like there might have been one. I like these rusty iron things. Okay, um, there appears to be something in here, and I see a bear behind the wall. What is up with that? Why do I see a bear? Blue enchanted crafting table. Ooh, okay. I feel like there's something... Okay, I'm not going to release you guys because um, it's not safe. Oops. Wait, I want to see what's in here, though. Why is there just a random bear? And what does this do? I'm scared. Uh... Okay, I don't know what that does, but we'll come back to it. It's like another one of those weird rock turtles or something in there. I don't know what that is. It looks crazy. Okay, let's see. What do we got? We've developed a new mechanism for using redstone, the randomizer. When powered, it outputs a signal right or left randomly. Okay. The randomizer. Here it is. Okay, that's kind of cool. Cloud in a bottle. Is that one of those... Is this one of those equipable things? Huh. Because it feels like part of this collection, like Terraria type equips a cloud in a bottle it feels like one of those so i was like trying to see if i could put it on but um can't do anything what is this I'm trying to craft something do not hit this lever uh why not iron bar it's a dropper i don't know where it's pointing at is it pointing over here yeah so it's gonna drop it's gonna drop an iron bar in here, which may send a signal. This redstone link is gonna do something with the bear and that, I don't even know. This is a weird looking creature. What are you? Okay, so I don't see another way out of here other than maybe like this. Oh, this is so cool. This build is so cool. Um, Alright, let's keep going up. Alright, there's nobody up here. Wow, this view though. Onions, nice. They're just storing vegetables. How wholesome. <laughs> okay. Let's go over here. Clear this area. I like these. Ooh, we got zinc and get some stuff. Okay. Interesting. We got a zombie dude. It's that person that that thing that was over here seems to have disappeared, so. Just gonna hop up here. See if there's anything else. Looks like this is just one of the other towers. 
Hey, you know what? Let's go down this way. <laughs> oh, what's in these barrels? Nether wart? Huh, okay. Bottles of experience. Interesting. Anybody in here? Anybody home? Got their stores, I guess, of their materials and stuff. Ooh, lots of experience. I like that. Okay. Um, I'm, yeah, I'm gonna have to check all this out afterwards, but I just want to make sure that I clear this place first. Magic log. Oh. Blue enchanted log. Okay. Potion of strength. Interesting. Alright, doesn't appear to be anything else up here. Can you... Just not. Alright, we got... Mundane potions. I like all the different bookshelves. It's just the different types of wood they're made out of. They're not actually, like, given any special abilities, I don't think. Okay, so this is just the other tower from there. There's nothing else to see. And then... Okay, so if I go back down here... Just keep looking. Um, did I go up this way yet? I don't think I did. Oh, hello. My pants are gonna break probably soon. Um, ooh, that one's got a lot of shinies in it. We got a lot of lightning rods in this tower. Ooh, is there a way to get up to the ship? Oh, that place looks so cool. I want an airship. Of course, now I have the freaking this bad omen uh i was gonna drink milk but i should probably wait till i'm done with this oh wait there are villagers here okay hopefully i won't need another bucket of milk dude i want to get into this airship but i don't think there's any way that i can even with my like really high jumps that i have I think I'll have to build up there. Do I have any... I have deep slate. I guess I have planks I could use. Because I really want to get up there. See some peeps down there. <laughs> My base is over there. <laughs> Sky high. I assume there's some machine on this airship that... Is giving me that achievement. Oh, I wonder if this thing actually works. Because if it's made with Create, it may actually fly. That'd be so cool. <laughs> okay, well. Let's see. What else is up here? Any enemies? Okay, we've got a little cut yourself machine. Okay, it's got it's got machines. It's got work mechanisms and stuff. Makes me think that it may uh, it may operate or it may be supposed to operate. Interesting. Okay, we've got some redstone stuff. Who 
threw a potion at me? Hello? What's going on? Somebody threw blindness at me. There's an invisible, there's like a hidden dispenser or something. Okay, so there was a tripwire there that I just hit. Wonder what that did. guys are rather tough. Need to find whatever spawner they're coming from and eliminate it. There we go. Something. Yeah, some like machine or something is like throwing those potions. Oh, maybe that dispenser. It might be like an observer or something that I'm triggering. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, I don't see anything, but some cool redstone stuff they're doing in here. All right, let's see. What else? Is there anything else in here that's interesting? What is this? Cartographer's quill. Hmm. So, is this something that I can use? Hmm. Like, I imagine maybe this is for, like, writing a map. That's what I was thinking. Uh, okay. So maybe when these guys die, they just like throw a potion. Yeah, they do. Okay, I need to get that spawner. Alright, yeah, just don't be there when they die. <laughs> oh, am I full of spawners already? Jeez. Killing too many enemies. Alright, I think that's everybody. Uh, fire protection, protection, okay. I might come back and uh, take some of this loot, but right now I'm all good. So there's an observer here. Yeah, okay. Okay, I think I saw everything in this ship. I've seen- wait, 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 wait. Oops. <laughs> oh no, I did go up here, okay. I think I've seen everything in here now. Hmm, yeah. Very, uh interesting build it's not like super cool on the inside but there is still a lot going on so that's kind of fun all right so let's try and ah uh, geez thank goodness for no fall damage i almost forgot that i had that i was like no i'm gonna get hurt but i was fine thanks to my bunnies my bunny feet 
All right, so let's see what else. Where else have we not gone in here? I did go through here. Yeah, I did. Okay. Uh, okay, let's go down. Uh, here's the like stairwell upper level. There's probably a few spawners in here. Yep. Thought I saw a particle effect there. Okay, there's these guys. Let me just try and eliminate this spawner first. This is a really cool fireplace. How does it have? Like, blast furnaces? Oh, okay. I guess it's probably supposed to be like a forge or something. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Um, okay, any more spawners in here? Okay, so I will get Bad Omen from him. Uh, let's see here. I think that's everything. Unless there's like a basement or something. Yeah, I might have cleared the castle already. Unless I just like entirely missed a whole wing of the building or something. Okay, let's check this way real quick because I don't know where this goes. And make sure that I don't miss anything. So I'm gonna move into here. I don't want any surprises, you know. Okay, now this is the same stairway. Okay, got it. Well, this has been a pretty easy defeat. Um, yeah, this place wasn't nearly as intimidating as I thought it would be. Um, this was actually really fun <laughs> clearing this place. Hummingbird feeder. Ooh, that's really cool. I wonder if it actually works. Um, but yeah. Uh, I didn't know that there were these cages in this mod pack, but those are pretty cool. I've, uh, I've gotten a few in another mod pack and I was having a lot of fun capturing little animals and stuff that I could, you know, put away, store for later. <laughs> oh jeez, my right click doesn't want to hold down very well these days. I think my mouse might be like getting too old or something. I want to kill you, but <laughs> he's not shooting me. Um, yeah, I want to kill him, but I need a milk bucket because I don't want to trigger a raid. Just put away this. I like the carpets; those are really fun. So I'm gonna have to patch up all these holes, I guess. But uh, I think this place is cleared. Pretty sure. So I don't see any like basement entrances anywhere. Like, this could be potentially an entrance to somewhere, but. It doesn't appear that it is. Can I close the gate from this side? Hmm, no. Yeah, this door was closed originally. And it all opened up using create mod. It's pretty cool, pretty cool dungeon. I feel like there's part of this castle that I didn't get to look at, but might have to chop down some of these trees that are blocking the front door place is so sick. Yeah, I just kind of want to like, kind of want to open it up. Oof, it's gonna take a lot of my axe durability breaking these. Oh. Come on, tree chopper. Chainsaw or whatever. Do the thing. There we go. That's weird. That one didn't want to chop down. Huh. Oh, there we go. There we go. Now we can see the castle a little better. Oh yeah, I didn't go out on this balcony. Did I just miss the entrance? I might have just run by it. Yeah, I did. Oh, sick. We're on the balcony of the castle. This place is so cool. Alright, well, time to go back to my my main base. I'll just pick up all this maple wood that I made a mess with real quick. You know what would be really cool is uh, if 
if I use like create stuff to uh, build like a railroad between uh, some like really nice like big dungeons that I've found because there's quite a few that I've found that I, like, I would like to revisit um, there was like the one this one that was like the the yeah the B like apiary one uh, oh yeah to like some of the some of the villages too would be cool build some um, trains that go between them this one was a cool village little winter wagon it could like it could like stop at all these like points they could be just like stations almost you know like stopping in between different different points and then you know you just wait for the train to come back around and you hop back on to come back <laughs> but uh oh that'd be so cool to do that i might have to uh might have to see if i can do that that probably costs so much materials but um if i get enough like mining machines and things set up i should be able to do it So yeah, I don't know how long this series will go, but um, I'm probably just gonna play until I ran out of, run out of things that I want to try. Um, I am re really enjoying learning about Create and uh, all that it has to offer. But uh, oh, and by the way, I didn't actually mention it. You guys probably noticed, but <laughs> I moved my storage. Uh, I did like a temporary setup. I set up this sophisticated storage controller. Uh, let's see, I might be able to drop a few of these items in. Yeah, I have some of these in storage already. Um, yeah, I don't know if it'll put, like, new items in the system. I don't want to put these in, I'm gonna just combine them. Um, keeping those. Let's try. Okay, so if I put this in here, it just vanishes, right? So yeah, it accepts items that are already in the system, I think. But if I want to put new items in, I'm going to need to uh, place them. So I'll put all these spawners in here. And I'll put these carpets in here and all this wood in here. Uh, but now, if I wanted to place the maple wood in, it'll just drop it in and then it'll be in this chest, which is where it was. So I can, like, have it organized, but it'll also, like, take items and stuff for me. I moved my seeds to a different place. Here, let me just put... Oh, actually, can I add it to in here? Yeah, I want to add it to my little bedroom. I want to build, like, a cool, like, giant four-poster bed in here eventually. But I gotta figure out what materials I want to use for it. And I put all the uh, other machines in here for like the kitchen. So I put the cabinet with all the food in it, uh, my cutting board, and the cooking pot, the smokers. And this chest has all the food in it. And yeah, I have some- oh yeah, I put all these like uh, crates and things in here too. And I have all my seeds out here. In here, next to my farm. So. Yeah, everything is it's way clearer out here now. I have a plan to do like a really cool like um, fountain and like garden, like a flower garden set up in this front area. So that'll be really cool uh, once I get that set up. I don't know if I'll do that on camera or not, but anyways, um, <laughs> we cleared the cleared the castle. Hope you guys enjoyed. <laughs> we will. Uh, well, I'll probably do some stuff in there. I don't know if I'll make that my my base very soon. If I do, it'll probably be like in the future. Um, cause I gotta have, I'll have to move everything. Um, and I've already got like a workshop set up over here and stuff. So it'll be kind of a shame to like have to be far away, but I mean, it's, a, it's still an option. I mean, it'd be really cool to live in that castle. Um, it's got a lot of space. That's for sure. <laughs> so I don't know. It's something I'm gonna have to think about. I think still, Zombie. He had like a backpack. Oh, but I didn't get it. Okay, well, maybe I should use my sword. Cause I have. Oh no, I don't have looting on my sword or my thing. Anyways, uh, I'll see you guys in the next part, and uh, we're gonna be doing some cool, fun things. Uh, hopefully, you will join me for that. 
being very vague, but um, yeah, I'll see you in the next part, hopefully. Bye.